Hi, I'm Holly from Twinkle and today I'm going to give you my top tips for maths loop cards. Loop cards cover a variety of styles and curriculum areas from shape to fraction, including some general packs which include lots of styles and curriculum areas and we even have a huge variety of multiplication loop cards which you can see a video about on our YouTube channel. Loop cards involve pupils being dealt a set of cards. Each card has a question on it and an answer to a different question. To begin the loop, a child reads out loud the question on their card, usually on the right hand side. The child with the card showing the corresponding answer reads out the answer. That child then reads their question aloud and so on until all questions have been answered and the loop has ended. Some of our maths loop cards have a who has style question. So it will be who has and I have. Others have a definition or a problem. Some of the loop cards have a start card, which means you must start with this question. However, majority of them are a full loop, so you can start with any card. Maths loop cards are a fantastic resource for any maths lesson, especially as a starter to a lesson. You could use the same pack all week, ensuring each child has a different card. And in this way, you know each child has had a turn at reading and answering different questions. You could also use loop cards as a plenary or a way to end a lesson, to find any learning gaps and to ensure knowledge has been learned. But also, loop cards are a great way to have a fun game in a lesson, during a lesson, in pairs, groups, as a whole class, or even a timed activity. Hope you found my top tips useful and enjoy using loop cards in school or at home. Thanks for watching.